I just want more to get back with another video. Uh, I just wanted to say that um, I finished the Panther F stuff, um, and I will show you. Um, I added some new stuff too. So first, I added these little boxes, little uh, sandbags. So that's cool, and I didn't use it for the tank either. It's actually really cool. Okay, now that's that. Then I bought this 75 centimeter anti-tank gun, and I, it comes with three guys and a shovel, you know, boxes, uh, old ammunition. So that's cool. And then I used for the diorama, I used this. So that's cool. These are two different boxes. I mean, two different companies. And then for the tank, I used the Panther F. That's dragons. So Tamiya and Dragon made this possible. Um. Okay. Now, here it is. The Panther F is was big. It's gonna have it sideways like this, but. I decide not to. So that I showed it in a different video of how good this was, and I used it in this. Um, so sandbags look absolutely beautiful, beautiful. Um, then from the other side, um, <laughs> yeah, the the commander looking over, telling some positions, the um. Uh, the, uh, what's this, uh, guy telling, uh, he's studying the corner, coordinates where the tank, the anti-tank gun will go. And then we got the loader here, ammunition box, some ammunition, then we got some of the dead ammunition that they, uh, they're done with, so they fired, like, four bullets. Um, so, I was gonna actually make it with the sandbags low, but... And the way I put this commander, it just looked better. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. And this this was really old too. So this is like from 30 years ago. So I put I tried to, when I put the stickers in water to put them on, they instantly just disintegrated. So that is the Panther F completed. Okay, so I'll just give you a round.